grace is sufficient for you. That you do not have, I don't have the capacity to wear God out. You're not that powerful. Somebody needs to be encouraged tonight. And I drove over from the south side of town just to encourage somebody that it doesn't matter how many times you've needed a redo, how many times you've needed to, to, to back step just a little bit and get the forgiveness and the grace of God. I came just to remind you that God's got enough patience for even you. That he doesn't need a good nap before he can handle what's going on in your life. We don't have the capacity to wear God out. I want to talk to you for just a few moments about the patience of God. The reason why I want to talk to you about the patience of God is because if you don't have a full revelation of the greatness, the vastness, the boundlessness of God's patience, then you will tiptoe, walk on eggshells in your relationship with God because you'll constantly be worried that if I do one more thing, that if I have one more misstep, that if I mishear him, that I, if I make another mistake, this will be the time that he puts me on the shelf and he can't use me anymore and I can't participate in kingdom purposes. The enemy wants you too afraid to experience the abundant life that he's called you to. So he wants us constantly walking on eggshells, worried. And I came to tell you that God is not mad at you. 